All day long, a seemingly endless stream of visitors flocked to the humble brick bar with a monumental legacy. The day culminated with a rally echoing the spirit that sparked a rebellion here. Earlier, the street outside Stonewall was the scene of a concert featuring a surprise appearance by Lady Gaga. I really, really hope you celebrate every inch of who you are today. You were born this way and you're a superstar. Several big names took the stage, reflecting on what happened here half a century ago. I think about those young trans people of color who have it enough. You're not going to shame me anymore for who I am and who I love. What do you want people to think about on this day? I want people to remember the courage that it took 50 years ago for those who stood up and finally said enough. Police raids on gay bars were common in the 60s, but when officers showed up that night at Stonewall, the crowd was fed up and fought back. That was our way of life, you know, you just accepted it until that night when the people stood up for it and then those around we joined in and it was a momentous, it turned out to be a momentous night. Now, 50 years later, Stonewall is a selfie-worthy symbol of pride and progress. It means to celebrate who I am, to be unabashedly myself. But in the LGBTQ community, there are still major worries about hate crimes, suicides, and the murders of trans women of color. So we have a lot of work to do, but this weekend I think is about getting our energy up, getting inspired, remember who got us here in the first place, and then moving forward on Monday. To those gathering here, Stonewall is about history and the future.